before. I know what she's asking, I just don't know if I can do it. And after. Thanks to research at USF, there may be a new treatment for the debilitating disease called ataxia. Anything from medications to neurodegenerative diseases to genetics diseases to even infections can cause ataxia. In the case of Susan Weir of Pinellas Park, it's genetic. She estimates that a third of her family, as far as five generations back, had the disease. Vision, bouncing, gait problems. People think you're drunk, basically. But a study at USF's Ataxia Research Center has Susan taking the smoking cessation drug Chantix and seeing success. What happens is the nicotinic receptor is closed, when Chantix works on it, it opens, it probably allows more acetylcholine or more transmitter to get through, which improves the patient's functioning. The center is now conducting clinical trials on Chantix in treating spinocerebella ataxia, like Susan's, and Friedrich's ataxia, which strikes children and teens. It's also co-sponsoring a series of events August 27th through 29th, including a gala to fund research that will hopefully help others like Susan. The neurologist, after I was on the experimental drug, was so surprised. He said, what in the world what happened? Great job. For University Beats, I'm Mark Schreiner. For more information on this University Beat or to view previous segments, log on to WUSF.org and click on the University Beat link.